Hello everyone and welcome back. Now for those who are wondering if the original keratin treatment or the Inverto Revolution keratin treatment, say that 10 times, by Keratin Research works on blonde hair, well you came to the right place. But before I continue, this is not a sponsored video, although I wish, but it's not. I have several videos about keratin treatments mainly by Keratin Research. Why? Well, because I love their products and two, I've saved thousands of dollars over the years by doing my own treatments. And yes, I get same results as I would in a salon. Now, in fact, you'd be surprised how many salons use this product. Some of you have seen a recent video where I did a treatment beginning of the summer where it's most needed using Inverto Revolution. If you have not seen that video, make sure you go check it out. I'll link it below. I love both treatments. The difference is Inverto Revolution has no formaldehyde and can be washed immediately. The original keratin treatment in which I'll be using in this video has very little formaldehyde and you need to wait at least three hours to overnight up to three days before you can wash your hair. Christiana is back. It is always fun filming with her. Beginning of the summer, I asked her if she'd like for me to do a keratin treatment on her hair and before I could finish the sentence, she said yes. So let's go ahead and get started. And here I thought my hair is high maintenance when it comes to frizz. Well, I was wrong. I'll never, ever, ever, ever complain again. Well, maybe once or twice. <laughs> well, let me tell you, her hair is 10 times worse. Sorry, Christiana. Plus her hair is shorter on the back, which makes it hard to manage and style because it's very coarse, dry, and easily prone to breakage and damage. Basically, her hair is a hot mess. She used to bleach it for years until about three years ago when she switched to an eco and vegan friendly, ammonia free and paraben free permanent hair color by Nature Tint in the shade 9N Honey Blonde. She swears by this product and highly recommends it. So ladies, if you're tired of bleaching your hair, this might be for you. And as always, all products used will be listed below. Oh, and remember, for those who use this or any treatment for the very first time, always, always, I cannot stress enough, always do a strand test before applying any type of solution all over your hair to make sure you're not allergic or your hair doesn't fall out. No, I'm just joking. But seriously, just to make sure you're not allergic, I did a strand test on the back of her hair and she was fine and dandy. She didn't have any allergic reactions and her hair didn't fall out. I shampooed her hair twice using Keratin Treatments Clarifying Shampoo, but you can use any clarifying shampoo. I then blow dried her hair and made sure it is 100% dry. I combed and separated the hair into three sections. I poured about one and a half ounces of the solution into a hair tint bowl. Starting from the back, I used a hair tint brush to apply the solution onto small sections a quarter of an inch away from the roots. I then combed the strand so that the solution is distributed evenly. And I repeated these steps until all of her hair is covered with the solution, being very careful not to oversaturate. Once I finished applying the solution all over her hair, I combed it to make sure the solution is spread evenly and left it in for 30 minutes. I then blow dried her hair making sure it is 100% dry before moving on to the next step. I know what you're going to say, boy this is a lot of work. Yes it is and there's a lot more but so worth it. I recommend you have someone help you because it'll be a lot faster and easier, believe me. I then flat ironed small sections between 7 to 12 times each section. 
per instructions, flat iron should be set between 420 to 450 degrees. I set it to 420 because it's her first time and as I mentioned earlier, her hair is prone to breakage and damage and I certainly did not want to take any chances. She could not believe how soft and smooth her hair was when I was done. And actually, I was surprised her hair didn't change color or turn lighter by one to two shades like mine does when I do the treatment. Well then I kicked her out because I decided to have her leave in the solution for at least a day and have her come back the next day for more torture. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I washed her hair with sulfate free shampoo and deep conditioned it with Keratin Research Hair Mask. And of course I had to blow dry and style her hair. Yes, I styled her hair. Keratin treatment is not going to make your hair pin straight. However, it will eliminate the frizz by 85 to 90, maybe more percent. And she absolutely loved it. When I say loved it, I mean she loved it. And you know what? After four and a half hours of work, I loved it even more because I was done. <laughs> Or maybe not, I just hope she doesn't come knocking on my door in three to four months or more because that's how long this treatment lasts. Should you have any questions, please ask away and I'll be more than happy to answer them. And let me know if you have ever tried any type of treatment and would you do it again. So what do you think? Don't you think her hair turned out great? Now you can find both treatments on keratinresearch.com or Amazon. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, I'll see you soon. Have a fabulous day. Take care. Bye-bye. Feels so good. Mm -hmm. Feels so good.